In tandem, PTC required SBS Transit and SMRTE to make larger contributions to the Public Transport Fund. Starting December 23, commuters taking Singapore's public trains and buses will have to pay higher fares. This as the Public Transport Council PTC increased fares for trains and buses by 7%. According to the PTC, the 7% increase is about a third of the 22.6% maximum allowable fare adjustment for the 2023 fare review exercise FRE. PTC will defer the remaining 15.6% points to future FREs. To cover this deferred fare adjustment quantum, PTC has requested the government to provide an additional subsidy of about $300 million for this year's FRE, which the government has agreed to, the PTC said. Following the adjustment, adult card fares will increase by $0.10 cents to $0.11 cents per journey, whilst adult cash fares will increase by $0.20. Cents. Commuters who belong to the concessionary groups, meanwhile, will see lower adjustments. To better support vulnerable commuters, PTC has decided to implement a lower increase of 4 to 5 cents per journey for concession card fares. The increase will be 4 cents to 5 cents per journey, whilst concessionary cash fares for bus rides will increase by 10 cents. About 2 million concession card holders will see a lower fare adjustment. The PTC will also provide greater support for students, seniors, and full-time national servicemen by reducing the prices of hybrid monthly concession passes by up to 10%. The government will similarly reduce the price of the monthly concession pass for persons with disabilities PWDS from $64 to $58, similar to that for seniors. Since operators SBS Transit and SMRT trains are expected to see increased revenue from the rate hike, PTC has required them to make a larger contribution towards the public transport fund. SBS Transit and SMRT trains will respectively contribute 15% and 30% of their expected increase in revenue, a total of $15.85 million, $3.14 million and $12.71 million respectively, to the fund, said PTC.